So I want to show you some of the structures we've been discussing um, actually on an actual, um, you know, brain, a human brain. And I've got it here over, you know, on the side in this, in this big uh, jar. <laughs> so this is an actual donated human brain. And, you know, you can see, for example, uh, this is looking at it from the side. This is the frontal, the frontal lobe. This is the, um, the front of the cerebrum. This is that this is the temporal lobe, which extends down here, which is under your temples over here. Um, you know, this is actually the occipital lobe towards the back and the parietal lobe towards the top over here. And this is, of course, the cerebellum, this very tightly wound structure where most of the neurons in the brain are actually found. And the other thing I wanted to show you about this is, um, you know, if you look right here from the front. So this is this is where it belongs, like right in your head like this. You know, your, the eyes are located right there. So right above my eyes is this, <laughs> is this. I mean, you know, hopefully it looks a little bit healthier than this. Um, but if you, if you see closely, there's this kind of stuff right here, right? This kind of weird kind of tough layer thing here. This is the dura mater, the, the outer layer of the meninges that we were discussing. Um, and there's a piece of dura. It's actually rather remarkable. It, it goes between the two hemispheres of the brain. So this is the left hemisphere and this is the right hemisphere. Um, and uh, this, 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 this kind of, um, kind of piece of dura, which, which goes between, it has a very distinctive sort of sickle shape. It looks like a, like a blade. Um, so that's actually called the falks cerebri, which is the, the cerebral falks or the cerebral, the cerebral sickle. Uh, in Latin, um, but the the meninges, the, the this outer tough dura, tough mother dura mater, basically surrounds all around the cerebrum, the the you know the cerebellum. It actually runs up here between the cerebellum and the cerebrum. It forms this tent over the cerebellum, which is called the tentorium, and then it also runs down around the spinal cord. And remember, the meninges you know consist of you know the the um, uh, the dura mater, which is, you know, you can see that little piece of it right there, but below the dura is actually the arachnoid, those very fine filamentous, you know, spider-like, spider-web-like cables that connect vasculature, which used to overlie, you know, this entire brain. There's a couple of places where there's a few vessels still, it's kind of hard to see it, but that are still kind of uh, on the surface here, but most of them have been torn off you know, when the dura was removed. Um, and then, you know, the those cables, the arachnoid layer, the middle layer of the meninges, you know, connect the dura, that tough stuff on the outside, to the pia mater, which is very fine membrane, which covers over, you know, the cerebrum, uh, you know, and other components of the central nervous system, you know, directly. Mm -hmm.